Hey guys, this is Tyler with Tyler's Dragon Tarot, and we're going to be doing Leo today. So, just want to say before I started shuffling, saw y'all come in as a lion, like, you bunch of liars. No, I'm, just, I'm playing, you a lion. Ah, sorry. Wordplay, I'm having too much fun right now. Kind of amped up for some reason. Um, y'all must be feeling it. But, <laughs> well, you are, because the lion's like, hear me roar, bitch. Um, God, your energy's so feisty right now. It's like, hear me roar. Like, I ain't gonna put up with shit no more. Like, Leo's usually pretty good with defending themselves. But, um, uh, okay, sorry, my dogs are really barking. Let me, um, let me check that real quick. Sorry about that, guys. Um, ever since I moved my dogs have been a little extra barky and it's just like i just wanted to make sure but anyway so anyway where were we we were talking about how feisty y'all motherfuckers are right now and i don't think leo usually has a problem standing up for themselves but you must be dealing with someone that you let fuck with you for some reason like you must have let some stuff slide and then now you're just like boom motherfucker don't fuck with me anymore like it's very sassy. I'm sorry for all the cussing, but I'm in your energy. And it feels very cussy, so I, I kind of feel like y'all don't mind. I don't know. Because how you're basically the ones doing the cussing, right? Okay. I feel like this is just saying you're beautiful, know your self-worth, and don't put up with shit. Alright? If it... If it don't fit, then don't put up with it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, that just really... Twin of airs. So maybe you have Gemini in your chart. Maybe you're dealing with a Gemini. Communication is key, is what I heard. Y'all ain't communicating. And that's the problem. They don't want to communicate. They just want to yell. I don't know why that's coming through. That must be, that must be for someone. They don't want to communicate, they just want to yell. They're not the friendly person you met. Cause Geminis are very friendly, and but they can they have a dark side just like everyone else. They let one twin take over. <laughs> but um uh, with this wheel, I feel like it's just like, alright, I'm done with this dark shit. There's there's a sunrise coming. I actually feel like it's the sunset because it's dark over here. So it's like, we're done. Sun setting. Like, I'm done with this bullshit. It's kind of how that feels like. See her face? She's just so over it. Again, another self-worth here. Like, wow. You are special to somebody. That came through pretty strong. You're special to somebody. And you may not, you may know it, or you may not know it, but it's like you keep asking to be treated better, and there's somebody who can, um, uh, you can be, can you come through a little stronger? Um, yeah, it's like you're spacing out, missing all this stuff, and you have it all around you. I feel like, okay, this is like, this is awful person A. And this is something else. This is another situation. And, of course, this could relate to something else. You could just be not putting up with a job anymore. However it relates to you. Um, not going to put up with it anymore. And there's something around the corner that's going to treat you better. And you, I don't think you can see it yet. It's not in your views. It's around you. It's there. But it's like you're just still so... You're kind of upset about this situation over here going wrong. So with the Hermit, you could be dealing with a Virgo, but I feel like that card has never screamed flirting to me, but it really is today, and it's just like, I kind of get a, oh, you feel that way. I think I do too. Like, you, you had to take time to realize it. 
But before it came out with the transformation, before you can do anything about it, before this, like I feel like someone's saying, is this a job offer? This could be. This doesn't have to be love. This could be a job offer. I feel like for some of you, this might just be a new job. I really do. But you got to let go of the old before you can move on. You got to let go of the old. All right. Well, shit, just popping up. The Emperor. Okay, so the I've been saying it with the other cards. You got Gemini, you got Virgo, and now you got Aries on the board. But that could also just be like... Someone who's got your back. Someone you know you can trust. Someone who, I don't know... I just see them protecting each other there. And it's like they're 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 kind of close. They're really close. They're cuddled up together. There's a lot of love. And it's just like any incoming threats, they're like, fuck off. We'll handle it together kind of thing. And it's like I feel like that's intimacy you're craving here. Or just trust in a how I don't know how that relates to a job. It could be stability in a job where they trust you to do your job. Cause I really feel like some of you this is a job related. They trust you to do your job. And somehow you can trust them. Like not to screw you over. Uh to know your worth. But okay. I'm gonna Let's draw clarification on this emperor. Draw clarification on the emperor. With this time to reflect, what? See, there's, to me, that says passion, happiness. But there's a balance between just, I heard lust and love. I was going to say something else, but lust and love just went, like, there's attractive, there's attraction, there's, um, what am I trying to say? There's attraction, there's a heat, there's passion, there's just romance, but then there's emotional support too. There's... You're not just left hanging. There's more than just hot sex. That popped in my head. There's more than just hot sex. I don't know how that relates to some of y'all, but I, I'm sorry. I heard it, so I said it. But I'm not really sorry, you know, because it's like popped in my head. You know, I I don't do personal readings very often, but I do them often enough that I'm like that. Maybe not everyone, but that related to somebody, all right? I mean, you guys are a fire sign. Let's just be real. Like, fire signs are very passionate, all right? Um, only one... Don't get me wrong. Other signs can be passionate, too. There's other signs that are really passionate, but, like, I'm pretty sure Scorpio and fire signs are, like, top four. <laughs> but... Oh, that's cute. Okay, so you got this balance between romance, the heat of the moment, the lust and love. And now you got to know where you belong. Like this cute little cat with the wings. It's like... You know, like you can't make a cat do anything. Like, and this cat has wings. It could get away anytime it wants. But for some reason, it's staying. And that's because it wants to stay. It wants to be there. And I feel like you know where you want to be. Why aren't you there? Why aren't you there? Hell, I'm asking that now. Why aren't you there?
focus than act. You're trying to get your thoughts together. You're trying, I, trying to get your life together. Like, I, it feels like you're like, okay, like, there's a dark side to this and there's a light side to this. Does the light outweigh the dark? But you're really holding on to that light and you're really, I feel like you're just really focusing in, or you need to, focus in on all the positive. Because, yes, there's dark and everything, but I don't know. Even the dark feels like it's just like, the dark doesn't even feel like bad dark. You know what I mean? It's just like, it's not dark. It's like you have support while you're trying to make the decision and and eventually that that you can't see is going to get illuminated that's what it is that's what that is i was trying too hard to get balanced there you might need to be balanced but see you have support that you can't see for some reason or that Maybe you know it's there, but you don't know how important it is or how much it is because you're too focused on one thing, but you need it to lie. You need to be able to see everything for what it's worth and then act. That's when it's time to act. And you got to see the signs. That's real funny because I was just like, you need to see everything for its worth. Now you got to see the signs. See, everything's lit up now. You can see everything. <laughs> hey, there you are. There's a little lion there. And so now you see what's in front of you. You'll start to see what's in front of you. That lion looks kind of like, oh, like you didn't know. And that's okay. You didn't know. But that's a pale lion. Like, you're a little nervous. Why are you nervous? You don't want to mess this up? Leos are supposed to have confidence, all right? What's up? <laughs> Be vigilant. See, have that confidence. You got it. You have that confidence. Use it. Use that confidence, Leo. Okay. Yeah, the magician. You know what you want. Go after it. Go after it. It's weird. I usually don't take multiple poppers at a time like this, but... Yeah. There's something that makes you feel all the feelings, like the fire, you're grounded, you're, you got the emotion here, and you're flying. And anytime you need to rest, you can rest on it. You're having trouble seeing what it is, what it's worth, but you know, you know, but it's like you're just, you got too much going on right now, and that's kind of the problem. Because you do see, you do see the value in it. And it's like, <laughs> you just gotta like, whatever this is, you gotta empty that before you can refill it. You gotta empty out, you gotta heal. You gotta heal before you can. And it's like, you know that. But you got that potion going on together. And you're like, you're stirring it up and you're just like, alright, what are we creating here? You got, what you're creating is a new balance and a new cycle here. With that earth and... Uh, yin yang symbol in there. And we got balance again. Like, finally, give and take. It's on both sides because there's three pinnacles on both sides. So, you can actually see the effort matched because it wasn't before. All right. <laughs> Why am I going to title this video? The bad ends, so the good begins. I y'all don't need to see this. Thank you for watching. 
Um, I appreciate all the likes, comments, subscribes. You guys are awesome. Have a great day.